I think a year after Rogue One came out that I received a phone call. Uh, and it was about, it was like, I, I, would you be willing to explore this possibility? You know, obviously they were not gonna move a finger unless I was in because <laughs> it would have been difficult to do it, you know? Uh, so, so they asked me, would, would you like to, to, to explore this with us? And, uh, and it felt completely right, you know? Rogue One is a, it's a, it's, it's a wonderful film and I love it, but it's about an event. You don't get to know much about these characters. You don't, you don't get the answers, you know, about who they are, what happened in, in their life for them to, to be willing to sacrifice everything for a cause, you know? And I, and I thought it was very interesting to go back and challenge every idea you may have about who Cassian was, you know, and, 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 and what needs to happen to someone to get there. Uh, I think that's, that's where the, 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 the ambitious take on this is, you know, it's like, uh, you never start thinking uh, about a story backwards, you know? Even though you're not gonna believe where he starts and you're gonna be like, what? Is that man really capable of what he does in Rogue One? Well, the right amount of things need to happen. The right amount of people needs to cross his life and, and, and in a meaningful way in order for him to become that man, you know? And that's what this journey is about and that's when uh, uh, I think what, what, what would be interesting for audiences.